Friday morning, February 14th, a Christian named Meadow was gunned down near his home during the night. His pregnant wife sits overcome. On the edge of Kagabandaro, the anger is palpable as neighborhood young people dig his grave. They say local Muslims killed him. We do not need Muslims here. We want the international community to help us find a solution right now. If the Muslims come out here, if the Salika come out here, we will kill them. They say they are fed up. We are within our rights to revolt. The violence they want, we will go to the end. On the way back to town, women and children are fleeing into the bush. They say there could be trouble today. Anze Balika fighters are in positions near their camp on the edge of town. The anti balika militia oppose the mostly Muslim Salika rebel coalition and the Chadian Miska troops, as the African Union peacekeeping force is called in the CAR. They accuse the Chadians of siding with Muslims. Salika took the town in December 2012. Several Selika groups are here now. In town, the market is shuttered. Miska troops patrol. Some Muslim residents are getting ready to head north to Chad. We were born here, but now with this religious war, we are fleeing to Chad for refuge. If this divides the country, we will come back to our part. Selica members say Miska has told them to keep the peace. They say they will not act unless provoked. If the anti balaka come into this town, we will finish them. Back in the Christian neighborhood, people say they have received threats and don't feel safe going to the cemetery. A Chadian Miska commander offers an escort. He tells them his men are not taking sides. This is the fifth murder this week. One Muslim and four Christians. Local authorities have declared a curfew. Toman Domete is mayor of Kagabandaro. There are lots of weapons. We need immediate disarmament on all sides. What worries me is I understand that the shopkeepers have guns as well. Residents say they need more international troops. We are not in security. We want the troops reinforced so we can be in peace. Miska's soldiers escort the body through town. Neighborhood youth follow on foot. Their rage gives way to grief. They don't linger. Miska troops escort them home, and the day finishes more or less in calm. Some French reinforcements arrive over the weekend. And look, VOA News, Cacabandoro, CAR.